Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm gonna to show you how to set the auto retract feature on your new 2021 Subaru Outback or Subaru Legacy. It's the same design, the same exact feature. So if you have either of those cars, this video will help you with both. If you guys are new to my channel and you like Subaru related content, then please consider clicking that subscribe button down below. If you get value and enjoy this video, then please smash the like button and leave any comments down below with any questions that you have. If you're unfamiliar with the facial recognition on the new Subaru Outback and the Subaru Legacy, this is how you can tell if it has it. There's a little infrared bar right here that will scan your face when you get in the car and set your memory seat and mirror positions. And so now I'm gonna show you how that works with the memory seat position and the auto retract feature on. So with the auto retract feature on, whenever you come up to your car, it's locked right now, it unlocks and the seat automatically moves back. So that way you have room to get in comfortably. It'll scan your face. It'll say, hello, Alex. And it's gonna move the driver position seat back to my specific preferences. So it's really easy to do. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to set this up. We're first gonna start the car. And from the home screen, you just click on settings. You scroll over from the top on car, select car. And then right here, you'll click on driver monitoring system. Now, if you're going to set up your driver profile to use the facial recognition to save your memory seat position and your memory mirror, then uh, you'll wanna click on register user and allow it to scan. Um, now this I've already done in a previous video. So if you want to see how to set your driver profile with the facial recognition, just click on the top right uh, YouTube card and that'll send you to that video. But for, for now, we've already got that set. So we already have our facial recognition set for our memory seat. Now we're going to set the auto retract feature. Now I've already got it turned on because I've already set this up, but we're gonna, whenever you get into this menu item, it's probably gonna be turned off as a default. So where it says auto retract seat on entry, you click that to toggle it on where it shows blue. Now we're gonna shut the car off and move the seat back to the auto retract setting that you want. So we'll move it pretty far back just to show you for the purposes of this video, but you may not need it this far. So now we've already got our driver profile position, our driving position set. Now we have our seat in the position that we want it to retract to. And in order to set that, there's a set button over here. So we're gonna click and hold set. And then we're going to single click just the unlock button, which is the Subaru logo. So we're gonna click and hold, set, single click on the Subaru logo and you hear it beep. So now we're going to move the seat forward just so we can see how this auto retracts. So we're just moving it forward, not to any spe specific location, but just forward. And we're gonna get out of the car. I'm gonna use the keyless access lock so we're gonna lock it and then the keyless access unlock. Then whenever you open the door, the seat is moving back all on its own. So once we get in the car, it's going to detect my face and it's going to start moving forward all on its own. It says, hello, Alex. So it's moving all on its own. So now my uh, seat is back in the driver position. I'm ready to go. So I hope that you guys found this video helpful. If you did, please be sure to smash the like button. Leave those comments down below with any questions you have. And maybe if you have a question that I haven't covered before, I'll make a dedicated video to do that just like this one. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in the next one.